9 raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of s from this given nice equation. 9 raised to power x minus 3 raised to power x is equal to 6. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation. 9 raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. 9 raised to power s can be written as 3 square raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Note that if you have a raised to power n, raised to power m this is equal to a raised to power m raised to power n now we have 3 raised to power s square minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6 let 3 raised to power s is equal to y let 3 raised to power s is equal to y now we have y square minus y is equal to 6 then we have y square minus y minus 6 is equal to 0 this is a quadratic equation which can be solved by using either factorization method or quadratic general formula but in this case we are going to consider the two formulas to know if we are going to get the right answer now let's use factorization method first in factorization method we look for two numbers so that the product will be minus six and the sum will be minus y then we have y square minus 3y plus 2y minus 6 is equal to 0. This is by factorization method. Now we have y into y minus 3 plus 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now we have y minus 3 here and y minus 3 here. This is y and this is 2. Now we have y plus 2 multiplied by y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now y plus 2 is equal to 0. Therefore, y is equal to minus 2. Or from here, y minus 3 is equal to 0, therefore, y is equal to 3. Now, this is our y2, and this is our y1. Now, we've gotten the value of y to be what? y is equal to minus 2 and 3. But, 3 raised to the power s is equal to y, then we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to 3. Now, this is the same thing as power of 1. They have the same base, s is equal to 1. Then for all, we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to minus 2. But we know that 3 raised to the power s is positive and this is negative. Then we reject this. Therefore, the only true solution we have is s is equal to 1. That is the value of s. Let's check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong. We want to check. We have the given equation 9 raised to the power s minus 3 raised to the power s must be equal to 6. 
now at s is equal to 1 we have 9 raised to the power 1 minus 3 raised to the power 1 must be equal to 6 this is 9 minus 3 and 9 minus 3 is equal to 6 meaning that the left hand side is 6 which is equal to the right hand side we satisfy the given equation at s is equal to 1 now let's solve this equation using quadratic general formula in quadratic general formula we have s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and we have the given equation y square minus y minus c is, is equal to 0. In this case, a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 1, c is equal to minus 6. Now let's substitute. Let's substitute. We have s is equal to minus into minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by minus 6 divided by 2 multiplied by 1. Then this is minus times minus plus. We have s is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square. This is 1. Minus 4 times 1 times minus is that is plus 24 over 2. This is 2 times 1. Now we have s is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of what? 25 over 2. Remember we are looking for y. So in this case, our s, note that s in this case is equal to what? y. So because we are looking for y, now we have y now equal to what? 1 plus square root of 25. This is 5 over 2. y is equal to 1 plus 5. This is plus or minus, sorry. We have 1 plus 5 over 2 or y is equal to 1 minus 5 over 2. Now from here, then y is equal to 1 plus 5. This is 6 over 2, which is equal to 3. Or from here, y is equal to 1 minus 5. This is minus 4 over 2. Then this is equal to minus 2. So remember that 3 raised to the power s is equal to what y but here y is equal to minus 2 and 3 then at y is equal to what 3 we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to what 3 then this is raised to the power 1 they have the same base s is equal to 1 also from here we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to what minus 2 but 3 raised to power s cannot equal to minus 2 then we reject this the only true solution we have is s is equal to 1 you can see that if you use quadratic general formula or factorization method you are still going to get the same answer if you have enjoyed the class please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe thank you